Hey everybody, welcome to the Dano channel. I'm Dano and I'm back with more Jurassic World Legacy Collection action figure dinosaur unboxings. Today we're going to be looking at the Pachycephalosaurus. That name is a mouthful. Let's take a look at the outside of the box here. All right, we've got our Jurassic World Legacy Collection. Now these Legacy Collection ones aren't from Fallen Kingdom. They're actually from other Jurassic Park movies. This one I would assume would be from Lost World. There's our cool T-Rex, the Jurassic Park gates, Pachycephalosaurus. Now, here in the States, these can only be found at Target. There will be some Amazon resellers who put them up on Amazon, so there will be links down below in case you guys want to support the channel, do any shopping on Amazon, you can use those. Uh, here, let's take a look at Jurassic Facts app. It's a really cool app where you can scan the bottom of their feet and uh, you'll unlock some trivia, a digital version of this dinosaur. It's just a cool, fun little app to have, so I'll show you that in a minute. Uh, it's got a ramming head when you push his tail down. Boom, it rams. Here's some other legacy collection. We've unboxed almost all of them except for that raptor right there. Oh, or that spitter. I don't have that Dilophosaurus. I want it, though. Um, there's more coming soon, apparently. Looks like zero to three sad babies approve of this Pachycephalosaurus. We'll call him Pachy for short. Very good-looking figure. I think he's a little different than the other one. So there is a battle damage Pachy that I picked up from Walmart because Walmart's got the battle damage one. So this is a fallen kingdom version but this is the legacy collection so let's take a look at him and we can also take a look at the lost world version and then there's a smaller lost world version that also came out let's compare them all why not now as i'm unboxing him and i mentioned the whole amazon thing like i always do again if you're an amazon shopper using those links helps me out and doesn't cost you anything extra which is always appreciated i think i got one more little one on his leg there i can snap out but i also sell t-shirts i sell hats there is some of my collection from other types of collection stuff that i have up on my ebay store because i'm moving i gotta move a lot of this stuff and i don't want to move it so i'm trying to sell it so if you guys want or are interested there's a link to my ebay store down below if you're watching this in june of 2018 if you're watching this any other time then there might still be stuff on the ebay store what my plan is going forward is so i don't run out of room <laughs> like I ran into at this house. Um, I'm going to start selling off my collection. I'm going to review something. If I really, really, really like it and want to keep it forever, I'll keep it. If I don't, I'm going to put it up on eBay and I'm going to sell it. And I might throw in like Dano Channel stickers or a note or something like that if you guys want. If anyone's interested in that idea. Either way, I think that's what I'm going to start doing. That way I don't end up with so much stuff, stuff that I may not like as much. Uh, I'm going to see if I can resell it. If I can't resell it, then I'll donate it. That's, way, that's how it's going to go. Or even give it away. But. We're here with the packy. I've got four packies on my table. Where'd my phone go? There it is. Time to get some close-ups of these guys. Let's take a look here. All right, so I'm going to pick them up. Overall, I, I love the paint job. I love the eyes. I love that dome on his head. Looks good. He's looking really good. I like all the... Just the sculpt on these things is amazing. So the legs on this guy, they do go out and in just like the other ones. Out a little bit. See, there's a little bit of give there. And then they also rotate on their own little axis. They rotate quite a bit if you let them. Uh, same with the arms. They rotate, but they also go in and out, so you get some good flexibility there. But he has this feature where you pop down the tail, and he can, like, dunk the other dinosaurs. I got it off camera, but he... Yeah. I like it. It's cool. It's a really... It's a cool setup. Nice dinosaur. The other one only had battle damage features. Now, this is something we've seen before. In fact, the one from Lost World, very similar... See, it's got a little Site B logo on it right there. You can kind of see it. Uh, Maybe-ish. There you go, Site B logo. Uh, there's a little button on the back side. And that makes the head go down. So you can do that and then ram yourself. Uh, there's also this one. This is the other Jurassic World ver Yeah. No, not Jurassic World. Lost World version. He's got a spring-loaded head. You pop down and you hit this little button on his back. But again, look at the size difference on these guys. I mean, it's huge. So these two compare to each other pretty well. Legacy Collection with the uh, Lost World version. Those two compare pretty well. But the deluxe Lost World version is jai freaking gigantic. Look at that. He doesn't even come up to his arm. There's a huge, huge difference in size there. So just kind of interesting. Kind of interesting. But, I mean, I like it. I like, I like the, the little head bopper. Little head bopper action. Head bopper. So let's go ahead and put him in the diorama, see how he looks. I'm sure he's going to look great. Oh, yeah. I like it. Now, he's not standing up because I got him on the weird ground right there. But uh, he should stand up otherwise. He stands up on the table just fine. I think it's all about the angle that I put him on when I put him in this diorama. Because there's some definite uneven ground and stuff going on there. But that's fine. He looks good. 
He looks really, looks good with his other packy. A pack of packies. And there's a lot of dinosaurs that I've just been adding to the collection, kind of just hiding out everywhere back there. There's like dinosaurs everywhere in this little diorama, and it's getting crazy. I love it though, it's kind of fun. It's neat to be able to do this 25 years later after Jurassic Park came out, to still be able to play with Jurassic Park toys. I uh, love it, let's see this in action. Boom! I think it's a solid toy. Decent toy. It's pretty good for the Legacy Collection. I like it. Alright guys, I give him a thumbs up, but, but with this caveat that if you're not super into this dinosaur, you don't have to get him. Like, I wouldn't say, add him to your collection for sure. If you're a completionist, yeah, get him. He's got a good sculpt, good paint job, cool little action feature. But he's not absolutely necessary. I don't think he's going to be that prominent in the movie. I hope he is, because they're always fun to see him, like, ram each other and stuff. But I just have a feeling he won't be. Either way, it's, it's a thumbs up but not necessarily have to have for your collection. I like him though. Let me know your thoughts. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Leave them down in the comments below with your reasons why you picked what you picked. If you haven't already done so, hit that subscribe button. Join the Dano Channel family. Be part of the Sad Baby Squad by taking a nice big dinosaur swipe against that little bell. That way you get notified every time I drop a brand new video. Something fell over. It's been a while since it was official. Hmm. But if you want to get notified every time you drop a brand new video, every time I drop a brand new video, unless you guys are dropping brand new videos, but I don't know. I guess if you have videos, you can share them in the Sad Baby Squad Discord chat. If you guys make your own vids, feel free to join the Discord chat and share them with each other. It's the community for you guys, so yeah, please share away. Go join that. There's a link down below in the description, so check that out too. There's a lot of links that are worthwhile, so you know it's good to read those things. Guys, that's it for now. Is it? No, use hashtag sad baby squad. Tag me on Instagram and Twitter at Dano Flores. I want to share your stuff in the vids. So if you have it, tag it, send it. Video clips, good stuff. Yeah. Hold on to your butts and goodbye for it. Guys, thank you so much for watching. If you've enjoyed this video series, do yourself a favor. Hit that subscribe button or I'll come bite ya. <laughs> you know I love you. Make sure to leave this video a thumbs up. If you like Star Wars, be sure to check out one of my other videos. But the best thing you can do to help me out is to share. Share my vids. Do that right now. Go do it. No!